Hej, cześć, witam was wszystkich bardzo serdecznie, z tej strony 352 i moi drodzy, witam was w 11 odcinku z serii Zagrajmy w Risen. Moi drodzy, mamy śledztwo do ogarnięcia i skończyliśmy tutaj przed chatą chyba tego gościa, który jest ym, księgowym? Jak to, jak to było? Kim on był? Coś w tym stylu. Just a moment. If I take three at 25 plus 18 hands, that's... I can't do this with you staring at me. You do in the accounts. I keep the books for the butcher's shop. There's a skill. You think calculating's easy? There's not many around here can do it. I can. Really? You want to test me? Yes. What's 14 times 17? 14 razy 17 odpalimy na szybko kalkulator. 2, 3, 8. 238. Very good. A man should value the weapons of the mind. About the break-in. What was stolen? What else? Gold, of course. The gold belongs to the order. Now it's gone. How much gold was taken? All of it. I don't know exactly how much. I was just about to do the accounts when I noticed a theft. Who was in the house on the day of the break-in? Well, Doyle tried to sell me fish, but I don't like fish, so he left. That fatto facility brought beer. I paid for that, traded him a few pieces of meat. And of course, Mo was here a few times, but that isn't unusually works here after all. Mm-hmm. Dobra, wiadomo. Hmm. Just endless lists and columns of numbers. Okej, okay, przez to, że to było nudne, dostałam tylko 5 punktów doświadczenia. Chyba, że drugi raz się powtarzył Doyle, prawda? Czy mi się tylko wydaje? Mhm. Mm tak, Nelson widział Doyle'a i Baxter też widział Doyle'a. No i Mo też się powtarza, no ale Mo tutaj faktycznie pracuje, nie? No tak, więc to nie miałoby raczej sensu. Kogo my jeszcze szukamy? Mm. Kartograf Nelson, sprzedawca futer Flavio. Sprzedawca futer? Futra. Tu jest tawerna upati. Może tu jest Flavio? Jest dytar. Hmm. Trzeba będzie się dobrze rozejrzeć. Jest też właśnie Patty, ale z Patty jeszcze porozmawiamy. Jest Ingvar, Wasyl. O matko i córko. Sprzedawca futer, gdzieżby mógł być? Nie mam zielonego pojęcia. Jestem w ogóle dzisiaj taka trochę nieprzytomna, bo już jest wieczór. A ja dzisiaj od rana w sumie na nogach jestem. Znaczy codziennie jestem od rana na nogach, nie? Ale dzisiaj sprzątałam w domu, później jeszcze pojechałam do sklepu z Damianem po jego pracy. I w sumie wróciliśmy gdzieś przed chwilą z zakupów z centra handlowego. Więc... więc no. Żona rolnika, no okej. Okay. Ja szukam Flavio. Hey, wait a minute. Don't walk by. Try the best fish in town. This is your lucky day because I have one perfect piscine offer for you. You do. Buy one fish and get a second fish completely free. Two fish for the price of one. Sounds like a good deal. I'm looking for Doyle. Doyle? I haven't seen him in a long time. Used to be a good customer of mine. Well, he bought fish from me more than once. That's good in my book. But maybe you could jog my memory, eh? Mm-hmm. You 
pretty talky for someone who sells fish. Oh, I figure the longer I keep someone talking, the more chance they have of buying some fish. I never should have bought this lousy fishmongers. I was with this wench. She said she liked fish, and then... Oh, before you know it, I've bought this thing. I mean, I don't know my herring from my halibut. And with the storms, there aren't even many fish being caught. Okay. Why don't you sell the store, then? Do you want it? Why would I want a fish store? See? That's what I should have said to myself. But that wench was so very beautiful. Skoro była, to znaczy, że się chyba nie udało. What sort of fish do you have? Everything the sea can provide. Herring just caught and placed so fresh it doesn't even know it's dead yet. Is that all? No. I also have shark. A nice shark steak will revive the weariest spirit. And you look like you could do with that. Show me your fish. You actually want to buy some? Well, don't forget, it's two for one. Mm-hmm. Dobra, rekin, śledź. Is there anything I could do to help? Well, you could find someone who wants to buy this store. Ideally, someone who knows about fish. How much do you want to sell your store for? Hmm. Well, including all the goods, let's say 300 gold pieces. I'll find you a buyer for your store. Wonderful! Might be handy if you look for someone who is drunk, or crazy, or loves fish. I'll keep that in mind. I have faith in you, my friend. Here, have a shark steak on the house. Oh, dziękuję bardzo. Where do you think I can find a buyer? If I knew, I'd have asked them myself. Maybe the harbour? The tavern? You could ask the fishermen. At least they'd know about fish. Where is Doyle? I last heard he'd taken quarters with Costa. But since then, he hasn't been seen in the gutters. Maybe he's gone into hiding for some reason. Lots of strange goings on around here. No, dobra, fajnie. Tylko jeszcze potrzebuję sprzedawcy futer, Flavio. Tu jest bardzo duże zgromadzenie ludzi. Ha. W sumie. To otwórzmy sobie. Tu jest Finn, Giles, jest Belchfur, Strażnik, jest Flavio. Welcome, welcome. I am Flavio the Merchant. Hello, Flavio the Merchant. I bet you're looking for work. I can't give you any. You'll have to try somewhere else. You don't have any work to offer? Since the town gates have been closed, my hunters can't get out. So there is no more hunting, no hunting, no catch, no gold. We all just have to tighten our belts. Do you have any jobs that can be done in the town? Uh, well, there's one thing. We all could really use a delivery of meat. Where does it need to go? Master Belcho needs it. You just have to get the meat from the slaughterhouse. I've already talked to Baxter down there, but he wants ten skins before he'll hand over any meat. So you want me to find these skins? If you manage that, then at least we'll have some meat. Don't you have any skins? After all, you deal in them. No, my stores are empty. The Don's men have helped themselves too many times. My boys, Pavel or Cole, might have a lead. Maybe they know something. Mm-hmm, dobra. What's in it for me, if I come up with the skins? You want to be paid for your work. I don't have much. I can offer a few arrows, and you'll make some friends. Okay. I'll find these skins for you. Thanks. Five boar skins and five wolf skins. And take them to Baxter. Once you have the meat, take that to Master Belchior. Wydaje mi się, że nie mam dzika skóry. What do you sell here? Hunting trophies. Skins, claws and teeth are my business. I pay for good catches, I'll even provide you with new arrows. Well, I used to. Zaraz, przed chwilą powiedział, że nie ma skór. No i faktycznie nie ma. Ale mamy nowe chyba narzędzia, nie? 
Łamać żądeł i szczypce do szczęk. Zaraz. Zaraz sprawdzimy. Nożyce do skrzydeł mam. Duto do szczęk. No wygląda na to, że tego nie mamy, więc... O Jezu. Więc sobie weźmiemy. No i dobra. About the break -in. What was stolen? Ah, uh, my hides. If that hadn't have happened, I would have been able to carry on my business. Oh, I should have listened to my father and gone to sea. That would have saved me a lot of trouble. Who was here on the day of the break-in? Just the usual day laborers who wanted to push their wares off on me. <sighs> like I have any gold left. Anyone else? Ah, uh, Pavel was here the whole day. After all, he works for me. And Vasily wanted to sell me beer from the tavern. And then there was Doyle. He wanted to sell fish, but I sent him away. That was all. No, Doyle się już powtarza któryś raz, więc chyba jest coś na rzeczy. Podobno u Kostara jest tak, no to... Ogarnijmy tę sprawę. No jest tutaj. What do you want here? I could ask you the same thing. I sleep here. Nothing wrong with that, is there, mate? You were seen in a house that was burgled. I sell fish door to door. I spend time in people's houses. If you say so. You're the only person seen in all the houses that were broken into, which makes you a prime suspect. Come off it. You can't prove that, mate, and you know it. I can beat a confession out of you. That would be a big mistake, mate. I'll take the chance. Or we skip the beating and you tell me the truth. And if I do, will you help me? Or will you hang me out to dry? Just tell me. I kissed the houses for Sid. There. Not so hard, was it? But what do I do with this information? If Sid hears I've talked, he'll feed me to the rot worms. And if the order finds out, they'll send me to the monastery. You've got to keep this quiet. Dobra, odeszli w ręce zakonu. You will surrender to the order. No, please, no. I can't go to the monastery. First, you stay here and hide. But Sid'll find me, and he'll kill me. I'll take care of Sid. With the statement you gave me, I'll get him. Shit and fire. That's not going to be easy. Pozbądź się Sida. A moment, moment. A czym mamy zadanie? Pozbądź się e, Delgado. Mamy. Dobra. No to Elo. To wiecie co? Jeszcze się najpierw pójdę przekimać, bo się robi po mało noc, a ja nie chcę biegać po ciemku. Do rana. Problem jest z tym naszyjnikiem z pereł, ponieważ potrzebny jest zwój otwierania zamków, którego ja chyba nie mam. Znaczy są inne sposoby, ale mi to nic nie da, bo nie mamy trzeciego poziomu otwierania zamków. Nie wiem, idziemy od razu do tego? I found Sid's spy. And Sid ordered him to do it. Right? Yes, it was Doyle, one of the day laborers. He's scared to death and does not want to go back to the monastery. Doyle's prepared to give evidence to the Inquisition. Really? It's good to know in times like these people can still surprise you. I didn't give him a choice. You need to confront Sid with what you know. We can bring this to an end. 
Dobra, no to idziemy do Sida. What about the skins from Flavio? What about them? Did you steal them as well? Yeah, but I sold them a long time ago. If you're after skins, look elsewhere. Like where? Do I look like a skin merchant? I found your spy. It's Doyle. The idiot. I thought he was better than that. Doyle's gone to the Order. He's turned himself in. What? He'll tell them everything. What are you going to do? If I stay, I'm in a sea of trouble. I need to get away. Yeah, I'll head out as soon as I can. Hoping the mess this town's become, I'll get forgotten. Whatever happens, I'm not letting the order take me to the monastery. No, i dobra, posidzie. I'm sure you've got things to do. Mam nadzieję, że dalej mam możliwość dania jej tego pierścienia. Raczej Nelsonowi oddania. Złote misy skóry na mięso. Zobaczmy, czy ja mam skór tyle, ile trzeba. Osiem dzi... Dobra, na luzie. Is the map done? The more often you ask. Dobra, dalej nie masz mapy. Pewnie ją zrobię, jak będę musiała z miasta wyjść. Znając życie. <coughs> Sid is trying to flee the town. Let him go. He'll just cause trouble if we put him in the monastery. At least the town will be free of his influence. Here, with the thanks of the order, we could do with more like you. Dzięki stary. No to co my teraz robimy? Dobre pytanie. Ach, możemy iść do Baxtera, nie? I'm here about the deal with Flavia. Flavia? Tell him I still don't have the goods. Five wolf skins and five boar skins. No more, no less. And I'll only take the complete delivery. Here are the skins Flavia promised. Yeah. Let's see. Here, yes, these look good. Can we do business? We have a deal. I'll take the furs, you take the meat. Dobra, fine, yeah. Coś jeszcze mamy w okolicy tutaj portu. Mapa, perły dla damy. Szczęścia. Ach, karasko, no tak. Ukradli jej robotnicy, jest za tym lukor. To trzeba będzie też do tawerny iść, tylko ja nie wiem, czy damy radę dzisiaj jeszcze. Bo nie ukrywam, że troszeczkę nam tutaj jednak w tym mieście zadań zostało. Ale tawerna to już jest takie miejsce, które powinniśmy odwiedzić. I got the meat. Good work. Can you take it to Master Belcher? Jasne, przy okazji z mistrzem też musimy porozmawiać. Ha, nikt się nie pluje. To dobrze, to fajnie. Tu jest kater też właśnie. Customer, welcome. What can I get you? Kurde. A drink? Of course. Duże jest to miasto, nie uważacie? Hey, new in town. Gold burning a hole in your pocket. In the market for a valuable artifact. Yeah, of course you are. Unlucky you ran into me, cause I got the very thing. Uh huh. Who are you? Name's Dirk. I'm an acquirer of rare and valuable items. A treasure seeker, just like my brothers. Runs in the family, you could say. 
So you don't work alone? Alf, Deiter, and little old me. Triplets. Triplets? Thanks for the warning. So you and your brothers are traveling separately? Easier to find work that way. Although I've not seen Deiter for days. I heard rumors Alf was being held prisoner in the merchant's district. No idea if that's true. He don't seem too bothered. Well, if it is true, he can handle himself. <laughs> Toughest of the three of us he is. I'll see if I can help Ulf. He can handle himself. But if you're going that direction, then I suppose it couldn't hurt. So you trade artifacts then? Not much getting in and out of Harbor Town. People gotta make a living any way they can. Most of those ways. Well, you wouldn't write home to your ma about him. I'll soft looking for work until things pick up. I just want to get back to the ruins again. Good place for treasure seekers. Czy mi się źle kojarzy, czy oni później wrócą normalnie do pracy? Do jednej ze świątyń? What sort of artifact are you selling? Some kind of large golden bowl. You need something golden bowl shaped. This will be perfect. And it's yours for just 150 gold. Złota misa, ta. Okay, I'll take it. Here you go. Pleasure doing business with you. Carefully you show it to. The Inquisition and the Dawn's boys would love to get this. But I didn't trust them not to bash me over the head as soon as they got their paws on it. Tak jest jedna na trzy ze złotych mis. Dobrze, tu jest kater. To za moment. Może jeszcze wejdziemy na górę sobie. This lock is too difficult. No jasne. Huh. W sumie to nie wiem po co ja tu wlazłam. Tak, o, dla fanu chyba. There's a face I don't recognize. Don't go wandering outside the gutters if you want to stay safe. You're a town guard. Damn right, so that means around here, the law is what I say it is. Stay in the gutters and stay out of trouble. Why are there only a few guards about? We are the town's first line of defense. So we were the first people sent to those ruins when they sprang up. Most didn't come back. Or if they did, they were in bad shape. That was before Mendoza and his Inquisition turned up. Now it's his men that go into those ruins. And let me tell you, that's fine by me. Can you train me? Sure. I could do with a bit of amusement. It'll cost you though. I want to improve my fighting skills. Mm, dobra, uczysz siły i miecza, walki mieczem. I'm watching you. Dobrze, stary. Ja tylko patrzyłam, czy nie masz gdzieś złotej misy. Wiadomo, kto wie. Dobra, no to mamy tutaj mistrza Belszwura gdzieś. Poszedł sobie chyba na ławkę. Dobra. Otwieramy. No nic szczególnego. Ale możemy zebrać też inne rzeczy. No i fajnie. Wykonajmy jeszcze dla mistrza zadanie, bo też jest dla niego właśnie kłeścik. Tylko jeszcze się przejdziemy tutaj, na górę. Tutaj ktoś jest nawet. Tu jest coś ala kaplica. After somewhere peaceful, 
I'm Cole, by the way. Is this a place of prayer? This is the Shrine of the Holy Flame, a place of calm in a violent, lawless world. And you're here to pray? Yes. I pray that this will all be over and I can go back to being a hunter. Okay, to jest jeden z myśliwych. Do you know where I can get skins? Skins? It's hard to get much of anything in town, but I hear Baxter swaps his meat for skins, if you have enough. That's why I'm here. Do you have skins? I still have one. You can have it. Thanks. How can I get hold of more? Haven't a clue. Parvel might though. He is, uh, well, was a hunter too. In good times we were never short of skins. Tell me about the flame. I'm a hunter. I don't know much about holy things. Just tell me what you know. It's... The flame protects us. All of us. Understand? It protects the whole island. It's where the mages get their magic. They say while it burns, there is hope. But the storms don't come to this island because of it. Whatever it is, the flame protects us. You're a hunter? I am. Well, I was. What happened? Since the temples rose, no one's allowed outside the town because of the creatures. I was lucky the Inquisition didn't take me to the monastery. And what happened to your boat? I pawned it to Costa. Fed me for a week. And to think I could provide for the whole town with it once. Now not even Flavio has work for me. All I have left is Master Belshaw's stew. Can you teach me anything about hunting? I could. But if you're thinking of going on an expedition, there's nothing here in the town to hunt. Could you teach me archery? That I can show you. Okay. Can you teach me about hunting? Okay, zręczność i łuk. Porządeczku. You look like you're from the monastery. Yes. I am novice you. I assist Master Belshaw. Tell me more about this town. There is unrest. Many do not accept the Inquisitor's word or the reality of what is happening. If the Inquisitor had captured the dog, everything would be different. But instead, people complain, even as we seek to save them. Why do they complain? Don Esteban and his gang still have great influence. They seek to discredit the Inquisition for their own ends. Many believe the Don will take control as soon as the Inquisitor is gone. So only a few are willing to defy the Don, lest they pay the price later. What exactly happens up there, at the monastery? Normally, the monastery is a place of peace and knowledge. But now the Inquisition has taken up residence, it has become a place to train recruits. What do you make of the Inquisitor? He may be disliked by some, but he is the only one who can help us in these times. He will avert the threat of the Risen Temples and restore order. While he performs his tasks up in the monastery, he is reliant on us, upon his representative, Commandant Carlos, to maintain control. Tell me more about Commandant Carlos. He is a warrior of the Order of the Holy Flame. He spends most of his time in the guardhouse, but his warriors are ever vigilant, maintaining peace in the town, which cannot be said of the Old Town Guard. What's wrong with the Old Town Guard? In the days before the Inquisitor arrived, they were responsible for keeping order on the streets. Don Esteban had them under his thumb. They did what they pleased him. They would do anything for gold and pleasure, and still would if given the chance. But now the Order is in charge here. Alas, I fear, some of them care too little for the people. How do they decide if someone becomes a recruit or a novice? Most take the path of the recruit. They are trained to become a warrior of the Order. This requires them to learn the high art of staff fighting and the basic principles of magic. To tread the path of magic, you must prove yourself to the Order. Then you may be given the choice to become a novice. As a novice, you learn staff fighting, but only enough to defend oneself. After that, you focus on real study, the art of the mage. If you wish to become a novice, then you should spend time with Master Belch. Dobra. How did you become a novice? I volunteered. Master Belch said I have what it takes and gave me his blessing. After I convinced Commandant Carlos of my work, I was allowed to go to the monastery to begin training. One day, I will be a powerful mage. A master of the order. Jasne, stary, my też myślę, że nam się to uda. No to co, mistrz Belchfur nam praktycznie został, jeszcze jest Pavel. Hey, what do you want? I haven't done anything. That's quite a guilty conscience. No, I just, I thought, um... Thought, 
what? That you were one of the people who doesn't want us outsiders here. They say we're thieves, but we aren't. The Don's rabble are the thieves. So, are there thieves in the town? Oh, yes. They take everything that's not nailed down. They cleaned out all the skins in Flavio's storehouse. And the worst thing is that the rebels get away with it. No, I hate it here. I can't wait to get out. Do you know where I can get some skins? I don't have any. I can't get any either. But some citizens have decorated their houses with skins. Just saying, in case you wanted any. Yeah, that'd be stealing though. Well, there aren't a lot of wolves and boars to hunt in town. And if you haven't brought any skins with you, all you can do is check with the merchants. Oh, and the slaughterhouse might have some left. Where are you from? All over. I'm a hunter, or was before the Order locked me up here in this town. You don't sound terribly happy. Of course. If they're going to lock everyone up here, they should look after us. Instead, they treat us like criminals. But the Order just leaves us here, leaves us to our fate. Mm -hmm. Dobra, widzę, że Paweł nie ma dobrych skojarzeń. No to co, porozmawiajmy z mistrzem. May the holy flame light your way, stranger. Are you looking for a spot of warm fire or some stew to solve your hunger? I've brought you some meat for the needy. Really? Flavio said you could use it. That I can. There are some more refugees driven here by the creatures in the temples, by the Don. We even have some refugees from other islands. We need help if we are to care for them all. You're a mage. I am that. I am Master Belshaw, a guardian of the Holy Flame, ordained into the Convocation of Mages. What is it you do in the town? I help those who are unable to help themselves. For now, that means providing food, shelter, other necessities. Why don't you help me? What can I do for you? Help me to care for the people. There are those who are sick and injured. They are in need of healing potions. I can distribute those healing potions for you. Good, good. Thank you. I have seven potions prepared. I will give you a list with the names of the needy here in the gutters. Consider the remaining potions payment for your work. What is the holy flame? In the monastery at the foot of the volcano, there's a holy place. It's one of the last true treasures of this world. The Hall of the Holy Flame. It's the source of our power, a well of magic. We must do all we can to protect it from the looming danger. What can you do with magic? It has many uses. There are spells which harm and spells which heal, and those that light your path in the darkness. With no study at all, you could cast from a scroll. Those scrolls can be used but once. Whereas an artifact with magic bound into it can last an age. But to create such items, or use magic without the need of them, for that you must become a mage. How can I become a mage? Hmm. You need a firm will and much patience to be chosen. As a mage, you would bear great responsibility. Are you fit for such a role? I don't know. A good answer. Quick to learn, quick to forget is what I say. Think then, and find your path. But dedication, not speed, is required for study. If you can show dedication to the Holy Flame, then I would see you as more fit for training. Right. Okay. I could use some stew. Here. May it grant you strength. Super, dziękuję serdecznie. Thank you. To co, idziemy oddać w takim razie te miksturki, a raczej zanieść. Elias, Cole, Finn, Josh i Marta. No to widzieliśmy od razu kola na górze. Here is a healing potion for you, with greetings from Belshaw. Ah, thank you. The order does try to provide for us. It's sometimes easy to forget that. Dobra, dalej. Uh, Elias, Finn, Josh, Marta. Gdzie był Finn? Czy ja w ogóle z Finnem rozmawiałam? Nie, bo Finn jest tutaj. Hey. Hello, I'm Finn. You don't happen to have any work to offer. No, I don't. Drat! I've combed every corner of this place. 
This town is a mess. There are so many people here now, and they all want jobs. Even Flavio can't give me work. What sort of work do you do? Anything. Anything. What can you tell me about Flavio? People say Belshaw is the only man doing something for the farmers. But Flavio has given work to lots of people. Has. But that's changed. Yeah. The warehouse is empty, and he had to get rid of most of us. Do you want to buy a fish stall? No thanks. I'm a farmer. What I know about fish, you could write on the side of a sprat. Someone in the harbour might be interested, though. Dobra. I have a healing potion for you, from Master Belshaw. Thank you. I can use this. Dobra, kolejna osoba to był Josh. Mamy też nowy poziom. Josh, Marta i Elias. No to wszyscy już są tutaj w tej części. I'm supposed to give you this healing potion from Master Belshaw. Ah, thank you. Refugees stick together, right? Dobra. I chodźmy dalej. Master Belshaw told me to bring you this potion. Thank you. Finally a chance for Martha. But healing potions alone won't be enough. I have to get my wife off the street. It's killing her. She needs somewhere to stay. Shelter. I'll find a bed. Some shelter for your wife. If you could do that, it'd be wonderful. Please, do your best. Please. Dobra, mogę z nią jeszcze pogadać? Just let me sleep. Don't bother me with this. Dobra, może mistrz Belszfur będzie coś wiedział na temat jakiegoś wolnego łóżka. Nie no, powiem wam, że jestem zadowolona mimo wszystko z postępów jak nam tutaj idzie, bo widzę, że zostało nam w sumie, takie punkty nam zostały. Żeby się gdzieś przejść, coś zrobić. W kolejnym odcinku już na 100% pójdziemy, myślę, że do tej tawerny. The farmer Arno needs a clean bed for his sick wife Martha. They both live on the street. I know. They're in a very bad situation. We really need a place to care for the worst cases. If only I knew where I could house Arno's wife. Could you search for somewhere? Perhaps Costa would help us house them. I can ask. Dobra, Costa, ale Costa by chciał zapłatę za to. Ha. I need to find clean lodgings for a sick woman, a farmer's wife. What does that have to do with me? I'll pay for her bed. Well, that's a different matter. If there's coin in it, then come one, come all. How generous of you. Dobra, czyli rozumiem, że możemy iść już do Josha z powrotem. Good news. I've arranged for your wife to stay at Costa's. Really? Thank you. Thank you. No one has ever done anything for us before. You're a good man and should be rewarded. We don't have much, but we have to give you something. Thank you, stranger. Perhaps the darkness will spare you. What is this darkness you're talking about? The darkness that will eat the world. Perhaps it is better to die now. Take this. May it bring you comfort. Dostam przepis kucharski. Leave me be. A jak to jest z tymi miksturami wreszcie? To się wykonało? Lekarstwo dla wszystkich. Nie wiem, powinniśmy chyba wrócić do mistrza, nie? I powinno być chyba ok, no jakby zrobiliśmy. Już nikt nie chce mikstur. Od nas. Ale to się zaraz też okaże. Fan lodgings for Martha. The farmer's wife. You are a good man. If only all the people in this town were as considerate. Here, I have something for you. May the holy flame light your way. Mixtura. Is there anything else for me to do? No. You've done more than enough already. If circumstances allowed, I would make you a novice directly. But we're no longer allowed to train anyone to become a mage without permission from the Inquisition. Are there no exceptions? 
Commandant Carlos is the only one who could authorize such an exception. If you decide to walk the path of magic, you should make sure to be in his good graces. May the Holy Flame protect you. Co jest z tym zadaniem? Um. Co jest? Elias dostał, Kol dostał, Finn dostał, Josh i Marta. Czemu nie mogę zadania oddać u mistrza? To trochę dziwne. I have other things to do. You going to stand here all day? Just let me sleep. Ej, no halo. Lepiej chyba będzie do każdego teraz zagadać. I spróbować oddać jeszcze jakąś miksturę może. Ej, dziwne. Elias był, Kol był, Finn był, Josh był i Marta była. Nie, Joshowi nie dałam. Moment, gdzie był Josh? Daliśmy Marcie, bo ten gość miał Arno. Josh. Kurwa, Josh? Gdzie był Josh? Nie kojarzę w ogóle go Josha. Znaczy się coś kojarzę, ale... Ale gdzie by był? Kuźwa Josh. A, już wiem. Josh sprzedaje to piwo tam na dole. Dobra, już mi się pokićkało. To zaraz będzie po robocie. I have a healing potion for you from Master Belshaw. Thank you. No i teraz możemy iść po nagrodę. I've given healing potions to everyone on your list. Thank you. Thank you. May the holy flame protect you. Perhaps you are suited to be a novice. In any case, you have my blessing. I will tell Carlos about your good work. He'll summon you when he has time. Carry out the tasks he charges you with. Convince him of your commitment, and he will take you to the monastery so you may study magic. He'll also provide you with a pass. Without his word, if you venture outside of the town walls, you'll be arrested by the warriors of the order. I see. No i dobra, i teraz się chyba już wykonało, no nie? Tak jest. No to co, moi drodzy, to wydaje mi się, że możemy dzisiejszy odcinek już w tym miejscu zakończyć. Tutaj już żeśmy z wszystkimi pogadali. Została nam tawerna. Jeszcze został nam też kowal. No ale tutaj głównie, nie? Jest ten Wasyl, sprawa tych pancerzy została. You, Carlos wants to talk. So move your carcass to the guardhouse. O, z komendantem już też możemy pogadać. No to nieźle, dobra moi drodzy, kolejny odcinek to będzie naprawdę wow. Dziękuję Wam serdecznie za oglądanie dzisiejszego filmu, mam nadzieję, że Wam się podobał. Jeżeli tak, zachęcam Was do łapki w górę, subskrypcji, komentarza. Trzymajcie się, ja lecę montować dla Was ten film. No i co? Kolejny odcinek będzie naprawdę ciekawy. Cześć!